everyone. Hello. This is my very good friend Ella, who you've met in the presentation I made. Uh, so I wanted to invite her to share her thoughts here on our on my blog. And the reason we're in my bedroom today is because our life partners, Ella's husband and Tomer, are sitting in the living room playing Battlefield Bad Company 2, some shooting game. And they're like eight-year-olds. Can't talk to them. They both sit like this. <laughs> and you'll see a video in a little bit. What the real? So I wanted to ask you, Ella, my love, what is it like to have a good friend like me with fibro? Fibro. Whatever. Fibromyalgia. Fibromyalgia. So, uh, first of all, we love you. And it's a pleasure to be your friend. Oh. Uh, and uh, I love you even though you have fibro. But uh, you're special. <laughs> I'm a special girl. Yes, you are. Uh, so, because you have fibro, uh, we have to treat you special. Uh, for example, we always come over to your house. Because I, they live about two stories up and it's way too much exercise for me to go up the stairs every time. Yes. Plus we have the TV and PlayStation here. Yes. So the boys can play. Yes. Um, or, or if it's Guitar Hero, we can play too. That's true. I sing, she rocks the guitar. I do. Um, and uh, when we come <coughs> over... Uh, we have to make room for ourselves in the living room because uh, there's the Shira couch and it's only Shira's. And everywhere else there's a big mess. So they have to clear the, the sofas and everything so they can sit. If you want to sit, you have to work for it. <laughs> <laughs> if you want to enjoy the living room, you have to work for it. You do. So um, <coughs> we make room. And um, also, uh, when you need help, then we try to help you. For example, if your cats have to go to the vet, then here's an example of a cat. <laughs> then uh, I take them. Uh, we share a vet. Yes, because you met Dolly, her dog, and she's so cute, and I knit her a sweater once. Yes. So they help me because it's... Because the, the cases are heavy for her. The cases of the, the cages for the cats. Yes. And uh, also it's hard for her to get out of the house and to speak and to walk. <laughs> <laughs> and to interact with people. Yes. <laughs> so I do the vet. And uh, You don't do the vet. You just... <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you do the... <laughs> Even though he would laugh if he would hear this. Yeah. So. Let's not tell him. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Um, we have a dirty vet. <laughs> so true <laughs> so um, another thing is uh, when you were hospitalized yeah when I just started with my pain and stuff and we didn't know what she had and we were all very worried about her uh, she was in the hospital for 8 days and uh, me and another friend Stas uh, we watched over the house and the cats and uh, <laughs> You know, just helping out. And they, and they really, really helped me out because I was freaking out about leaving all the cats there and what was going on. And but we did lose one of the cats. Yeah, but that's why we adopted Shanti. We had another kitty called Sony, and he loved the PlayStation as well. He, the Sony, that's why we called him that. Yes. And he was really, really cute, but he ran away. It's very sad. We're sorry. It's okay. Thank you. So, <laughs> um... Another thing is uh, sometimes we're very happy when you get under the house. It happens. Very rarely. <laughs> yes. But it does happen. It does. And uh, when she does get out of the house, then she drives. Mm, my Beamer. I yes. got a 98 Beamer. Yes. And when she drives, she looks like this. <laughs> <laughs> That's the Shira drive. Oh, leaning back. It's really pimping. Trying I really to, look like a pimp in the car. Trying to get comfy. Yeah, because I need my hips, because they can't be in a 90 degree angle. I have to have my back like this. Ooh. It's very funny. She's very pimpish. Yes. And um, when we get out, then we do stuff. For example, go to the hairstylist. He's really fun. Mm -hmm. 
and he's really close by. <laughs> That's even better. And uh, about uh, two weeks ago, we went to buy a dress for Shira's brother's wedding. Yay! August 12th. Congratulations. So happy, Barak and Michali. And when you go shopping with Fivo Shira, uh, <laughs> <laughs> you have to take many things into consideration. For example. Yes. Uh, <laughs> do not go into many stores because it's hard out here. Yeah, too uh, much walking. Do not let her try on too many dresses because it's hard. Yeah, it makes me really tired, the whole... <laughs> yes, moving around is very hard. I know. <laughs> <laughs> and, of course, uh, when you pick the dress, the most important thing is for it to be comfortable. Right, because I don't want to spend the whole night... I want to have a comfy dress. And no high heels. And it's in turquoise! Yes. <laughs> it's beautiful. Yeah. You're gonna look wonderful. I'm so excited. And um, sometimes we enjoy making fun of Shira. That's my favorite part. And it's the greatest advantage of Shira be- being sick with Fibro. Yeah. So when Shira uh, doesn't want to do something... Yeah, I'm tired. Oh, I don't want to get up. Then everybody goes, I have Fibro. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, that's the line. Not nice to make fun of the handicap. And also, uh, when we're happy about something, and, and we want a high five. No, no high five. Gentle fist bump. I wrote a post about this once, but this is an example of seeing it performed live. A gentle fist bump. Very gentle. Very gentle. And I still feel it. Mm-hmm. And uh, that's that. Yes. We love you, Fibrosio. Aww. I want to, first of all, I'm sorry I missed your wedding. It's okay. Did I already say that? No. Okay. Um, so I'm sorry I missed your wedding like five, four years ago. And thank you so much for all your help with the cats and with the house. And today she's helping me make dinner. And she, when the cat broke something here, she cleaned it up instead of me because she knows it's hard to bend. So thank you so much for your help and I love you. I love you too. Oh, I couldn't do without you. Oh. So, uh, so, that was that. And I hope you have a pain-free weekend. And I'll see you next time. Bye. Bye. To save me, come on.